Hello and welcome back to 2 minute tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Bing AI chatbot application on your system. So let's get started right away. First of all, as we know that we need the Microsoft Edge browser to access Bing AI chatbot, let's go ahead and open up the Edge browser. Now we need to navigate over to Bing AI website. So let's go ahead and type in bing.com and press enter and this will take us into the official Bing website. Now first of all, make sure that you are signed in to your account by clicking on the account icon at the top right corner. If you haven't signed in already, you can click on the sign in button and proceed with signing in to your Microsoft account using your email address and your password. Once you are signed in, click on the chat menu at the top right corner alongside the Microsoft Bing logo. This will now redirect you into the Microsoft Bing chat page. Now once you're on this page, just click on the three dots at the top right corner and this will open up the settings menu. Now just hover over to apps and click on install this site as an app. Now just click on install button and now you will see a notification which tells you that the app is installed. You can choose to create a desktop shortcut and pin it to the start menu as well as your taskbar. If you wish to do so then you can also set it to auto start when you log in to your device. After setting up your desired preferences, click on the allow button and this will finalize the installation of the Bing AI application. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to install the Bing AI application on your device. So how to log in to Bing AI. So let's get started right away. First of all, you're going to want to open up your web browser. So go ahead and open it up. Now in the address bar, just type in bing.com slash question mark slash AI and then press enter. You will now be taken into the AI powered Bing search page. Now you can immediately start using Bing AI search or you can sign into your account by clicking on the sign in button at the top right corner. After you click on it, you will be asked to sign in to your Microsoft account. So just go ahead and enter your phone number, your username or your email address and then click on the next button. You will now be asked to enter your password. So just go ahead and type in your password and then click on the sign in button and you will be logged in to your account with Bing AI. How to enable or disable the Bing AI toolbar feature on your web browser. So let's get started right away. Now as we have already established, the Bing AI toolbar is only available on the Microsoft Edge browser. Go ahead and open up your Edge browser. Now if you already see the Bing toolbar at the right side, underneath the close button then this is enabled by default. In order to access the enabling and disabling feature, just click on the settings button at the bottom left corner. You can now see the app and notification settings menu. From this menu, just click on Bing Chat and now you'll see the Show Bing Chat option. Just toggle this button off and the Bing Chat menu will disappear from the top right corner. If you want to enable it, you can once again activate this button and this will once again activate the Bing AI Chat. How to use Bing AI to write an essay for you. So let's get started right away. First of all, you will need to open up your Microsoft Edge browser. So go ahead and open it up. Now just type in bing.com in the address bar and press enter. Now if you haven't signed into your Microsoft account already, you will see a sign up button instead of your email account here. Just click on the sign in button and proceed with logging into your account. And now you can click on the chat button and you will be able to access the Bing AI chat. Now you can choose your conversation style from more creative and more precise or a more balanced approach. Now let's choose the creative approach. Now let's just give it a simple topic and press the enter button to provide our command. And now as you can see, the Bing AI chat is providing me with the response that I can use for my essay. It will also provide you the websites from where it is sourcing all of these information. So this is really important if you want to cite your references. Now you can also provide more tailored command in terms of what you want your essay to specialize in. And based on your specifications, Bing AI will provide the best tailored response for you. And as you can see, even all of the references are cited. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to make Bing AI write an essay for you. How to add Bing AI to your Microsoft Edge browser. 
so let's get started right away. If you don't have the Microsoft Edge browser on your device, then you can open up the Microsoft Store and simply search for Microsoft Edge. Once you find Microsoft Edge, you can click on the Get or Install button and this will install the Microsoft Edge browser to your system. Now just go ahead and open it up and you might be asked to log in to your Microsoft account. Now if the Bing AI is already installed on your Edge browser, then you will see the Bing AI toolbar at the top right corner right underneath the Close button. However, if you don't see it, then click on the Settings button at the bottom right corner. You will now be taken into the Settings menu. Now from the Settings menu, if you scroll down, you will find Bing Chat. Just go ahead and click on it. And now the Show Bing Chat menu will be visible at the very top. You can simply toggle this button on and you will immediately see the Bing toolbar at the top right corner. If the toolbar doesn't already have the chat menu, then you will first need to log in to your account. So you can click on the sign in button at the top right corner and then proceed with signing into your Microsoft account by clicking on the sign in button. From there you can simply use your email address and your password to sign in and access the Bing AI chat toolbar to its fullest potential. And there you have it, that is how easy it is to add the Bing AI chatbot to your Microsoft Edge browser. How to reset the password for your Bing AI account. So let's get started right away. First of all, just go ahead and open up your Microsoft Edge browser and then type in bing.com in the address bar and press enter. You will now be taken into the official Microsoft Bing website. Now in order to reset your password, just click on the sign in button at the top right corner and now you will be asked to sign in to your Microsoft account. Now just go ahead and type in your email address and then click on the next button. You will now be asked to enter your password. Now in order to reset your forgotten password, just go ahead and click on forgot password. Now you can find an option to send a verification email to your email address. You can simply select this option and click on get code. Once you click on this, you will be asked to enter your verification code. So just check your inbox and you will be able to find this code. Once you find the code, just enter it and then click on the next button. And now you will be allowed to reset your password. Just go ahead and type in your desired new password and then type it in once again to confirm it. Then click on the next button and now you will be told that your password has been changed. You can now click on the sign in button and proceed with logging into your account using your new password. Once you reset your password, you will be able to access Bing Chat once again by clicking on the chat option. And that is how easy it is to reset your password for Bing Chat AI. How to gain access to Bing AI chatbot on your device. So let's get started right away. First of all, if you open up any other browser such as Chrome and go to the Bing AI website, you will find the chat button at the top left corner alongside the Microsoft Bing logo. If you click on this, you will be told that you need the Microsoft Edge browser in order to access Bing AI. If you already have the Microsoft Edge, you can simply click on Open Microsoft Edge or if you don't have it, then you can easily download it from the Microsoft Store. Now this will immediately open up the Bing AI website and sign you in to Bing AI with your Microsoft account. If you don't have a Microsoft account set up already, you will be asked to log in. You can simply type in your username and your password and click on the login button and this will redirect you into this Bing AI chat page. And now you can simply choose your conversation style and get started with using Bing AI. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to gain access to Bing AI on your device. How to clear the chat history on your Bing AI chat. So let's get started right away. You can open the Bing AI application if you have it installed or you can go to the Microsoft Edge browser. Then make sure that you are logged into your Microsoft account first and after logging into your account, just type in bing.com in the address bar and press enter. This will now take you into the official Microsoft Bing website. Now click on the chat option to access Bing AI chat. Once you access the Bing AI chat page, you will see your recent chat history at the right side underneath recent activity. Now you can simply hover over to your recent conversations and you will find the trash can icon. You can simply click on this 
and this will remove your conversation. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to clear your conversation history with Bing AI or how to add Bing AI to your task bar. So let's get started right away. First of all, you will need to open up your Microsoft Edge browser, so go ahead and open it up. Now if you haven't signed in to your Microsoft account already, then you will be able to see a sign in button right at the top right corner alongside the three dots. If you click on it, you will be asked to enter your email address and your password, and once you enter those, you will be logged in to your Microsoft account. After logging in, simply go to bing.com and you will be taken to the Bing official website. Now click on the chat option at the top section and this will take you into the Bing AI chat page. Now in order to add this into your taskbar, you will need to install the web application. In order to do this, click on the three dots at the top right corner and from the drop down menu hover over to apps. Now click on install this site as an app. Finally, click on the install button and this will begin the installation of the application. When you see app installed, you will also see an option to pin this to your taskbar. Make sure you select this option to add it to your taskbar. You can also pin this to your start menu and create a desktop shortcut if you wish to do so. Finally click on the allow button and you will now see the Bing toolbar on your taskbar. You can click on it from any window to launch it immediately. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to add Bing AI to your taskbar. If you find this video helpful, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. Also ring that notification bell to never miss another update from us. Thank you for watching and I will see you again in the next video.